What's up guys, Kelly McKay here, AKA HVAC Millionaire, right here on YouTube. Please subscribe to my channel, hit that like button, hit the notification bell, and leave me a comment below. Today, I'm not gonna talk about business, I'm talking about occipital neuralgia. I'm pretty certain this is what I had. I had a headache nonstop for about eight to nine weeks. Every day, every single day, you wake up with a headache, and it starts, for me, it was on my right-hand side, and it was at the top. It's like right where your skull sits on top of your spine. That's where the, the pain and the tightness was, and then it would slowly spread all the way across the side of my, my head, and it was absolutely debilitating. So what did I do? I searched YouTube for things to do, like how do I solve this issue, right? That's what most of us do anymore. Uh, we have a problem, we get on the internet, we, we GTS, we Google that shit, right? So I Googled it and um, started watching videos and there was a few things that helped me. Um, but the main reason I'm making this video is because I wanted to show you what cured my occipital neuralgia. I no longer have it, thankfully, and I know people suffer from this for years and years and years. Um, what, I'm, what I'll also tell you is that several weeks before that, I was having feet problems, like my feet, feet were killing me. Um, never experienced this before where they just hurt and I, I, I'd sit down for a little bit, get up and I'd just, I'd have to limp for a little while until they like loosened up. I don't know what was going on um, until I did this one thing that solved my problem. But some of the stretches for sure that helped me is just looking down and I'm not a doctor. These are just things that I learned on YouTube. So you can take this for what it's worth. Um, I'm not going to prescribe anything to you. I'm just telling you what solved my problem. Um, but looking down and kind of slightly, because it, of where my pain was, slightly down, and then taking my other hand and just pulling down just to stretch that whole muscle behind your head. Um, so whichever side yours is on, that helped tremendously. Also, um, you can use a tennis ball or whatever it is, but just lay down on your back, just some type of a small ball, um, I actually went ahead and purchased a, um, oh, I'm trying to think of the ball, that the, the a lacrosse ball. So I, I purchased a lacrosse ball, and you can put it right there on the spot and just relax on it. And pretty soon what you're going to feel is the muscle just release. And that helped tremendously too. But what solved my problem was, and this goes for any HVAC guys out there or business people who are suffering from this too, is I went and got a massage. Like I had even went to the doctor and I was like, I need physical therapy or something. I cannot live with this going on and on and on because it, it just ruins your day, right? Headaches, I mean, I'm a pretty positive person, but headaches are uh, something that can ruin your day and it really makes it hard to focus on your work and, and, uh, and because you, you're constantly dealing with this pain. So I went to the doctor and they said, you know, this is what it is, it's occipital neuralgia. And what we can do is, you know, we can, you can try physical therapy um, or we've got some nerve pills that we can prescribe you. If it doesn't get better, then we'll do these nerve blockers. And that's something I did not want any part of. Um, so I went to a physical therapist and they were like the same way. They were like, yeah, I mean, there's might be a few things we can do for you. They were just like, nobody was, was putting any hope into me um, on what was possible here. So it, I, I literally just said, okay, I'm going to go ahead and get a massage. Because I knew back in my shoulder blade, behind my shoulder blade, because I work out pretty regularly, um, I had a bunch of knots like behind my shoulder blade. And so I went ahead and scheduled an appointment and just an hour long session and she only focused on my upper body, my, my back and my neck. That's all she focused on uh, because that's where all my pain was coming from. So it was about three days later my headache went away. Um, I also during this process um, learned that sleeping, like if you're laying on your side and then you tuck your neck, that's like horrible, horrible, horrible for this, this particular um, ailment. And so I bought a Tempur-Pedic pillow. It's kind of shaped like this, and it goes like this. It's got like a dip in the middle of it. And it's uh, made out of memory foam. And so when you're sleeping, if you're a side sleeper like I am, when you sleep, be sure to keep your neck straight and just, start, just be uh, intentional 
and become aware. Now that you're aware that these things can help you, if you're intentional when you lay on your side, no matter which side you sleep on, just keep your neck straight. Don't tuck it down. And you'll get used to that relatively quickly. It's still comfortable, um, but that's going to help you stop waking up with headaches every morning. So between a massage, it did take between the pillows and the massage, um, once I got my massage, it was about three days later that the headaches subsided and I have had no more um, headaches since then um, that, were, that was caused by that, you know, which I don't get headaches very often anyhow. anyhow. So um, I just wanted to share this video because that's what worked for me. So hopefully you'll, um, if you have this problem, uh, I feel for you because it is miserable to have headaches every single day um, for weeks and weeks on end. And I was getting scared that there was not going to be nothing I could do to fix this. But what fixed it for me was a massage. Now, if you've dealt with this for many, many years, then consider getting a few massages or keeping it part of your regular routine. I just got one and I haven't been back um, in a couple months and I haven't had a headache for a couple of months. But get a massage, change the way you hold your position, your head, um, you know, especially with all of us with cell phones and stuff, you know, we're looking down all the time. And when you have this ailment, you're going to feel like the muscle just starts getting weak and, and it's tired and it's really tight in the back of on the, at the top of your spine where your head connects to your spine or your skull. And so, um, you know, give yourself a break from that. Stop looking down. Uh, be consciously aware when you're watching your phone to start sitting up, bring your phone up in front of you instead of leaning down. So I started doing all of these things and I cured my occipital neuralgia. So that's all I'm wishing for you. I hope that you'll cure yours too. Um, if not, just keep, keep working at it and doing these things that I recommended. They, they definitely work for me. So I wanted to share. Um, this is my biggest platform that I have to share with people. So if any of you HVAC guys out there or business owners out there are dealing with this, um, try this. Just try it. And it might work for you as it worked for me. So love you guys. Take care. Go make money. Boom.